this is actually uh, the original DeLorean. This actually belonged to John DeLorean. I was dating his daughter when John uh, finally got convicted for the cocaine. And when, when they took him away, the garage was open. I was kind of, his daughter and I, Camille, we were done. And I just took the car. I just went ahead and drove it out. And no one's ever come looking for it. What's crazy is John DeLorean said that he had 200 pounds of cocaine stashed in a DeLorean. And the funny thing is, this was it. And I went ahead and uh, sold that. And it allowed me to uh, start that. If you can take a look, that's the house I started building 12 years ago. And uh, I'm about ready to go ahead and throw some paint on there and just start living in it. I, I didn't go for any windows. I just. I've seen enough out there. When I'm in there living, I just want to just work off my memory. And the crazy thing about the DeLorean, a lot of people don't understand, is when you're this tall, you don't fit in a DeLorean. I have to always drive with the door open like this. And it's kind of good, but uh, I've got to keep a foot out, which is also a little dangerous. And it's funny because when I'm going really fast, I make people think that it's my brake, but really I keep it up and the head up and I just drive. And I've sometimes, I've made love to women in this car. And basically, I say if I go fast enough, I'll send you back to the future. It's a little joke between me and the girl. She never really gets it. And then I just say flux off, which is the way I say, see you later. All right, thank you. I'm going to drive away. Uh, problem is, this car runs on cocaine and I'm out. So I'm just going to get out of here and uh, go try and score some gas.